Hello guys, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year because today we have a model review. Now, yes, I know things look so much more clear because I'm filming this on my brand new uh, iPhone 6, a regular iPhone 6. I don't like the 6 Pluses, they're way too big. They're like iPad minis. Uh, but, as you can see, I got a, uh, my other phone here. The only thing is, I just love my case for my other iPhone, but it's way out of date because it still has iOS 6, and now my other phone I got iOS, what, 8, 9? I don't know. But, besides the fact, we have uh, a Christmas present here uh, from Mainline Railways uh, with an authentic double-O gauge model. I must focus. I don't really need to see that. And if you would like to focus... Focus. Focus. Hold on. I'm gonna do a jump cut. Alright, I just have to zoom out really quickly. Uh, uh, it's a 2301 class Dean Goods 060 locomotive GW, GWR Green. Uh, so, I have a little info on my phone of the loco. If I read uh, power type Steam, designer, William Dean, builder, GWR, build date, 1883 to 1899, total produce, uh, 260, oh, let's see, what else. figuration 060, you know, the gauge, uh, 180 PSI for the boiler, two cylinders inside, uh, also, this is 2516, 2516, uh, I'll show you after, when it's out of the box, but yeah, uh, yeah, it's, it's a pretty good loco, so, um, let's get out of the box and see what she's like. Alright, well, here she is in the box, uh, doing pretty good. It's like the tenth time I've had to put her back in the box with the risk of breaking all this stuff off. But, that's okay. Well, I'm going to take her out of the box that I can't do it with the phone in my hand and doing film at the same time, so I'll be right back. Well, I've opened the window so we can get some better light in here. But as you see, she's a very stunning model. We could focus. The thing is about iPhone cameras, they don't focus. They don't really like to focus. Study more on the background. Alright, well, I want to get in some good details. Look at that. Oh, let's see. Yeah, so all you gotta do is actually just click on it. Oh my god, I'm such a dweeb, a noob. But look at that riveting and that detail. Oh my god. And look at this middle handrail running down the side. It's so pretty. So beautiful. So, so phenomenal. Uh, it's exquisite. Look at her. The cold detail isn't horribly bad for an old model. I'll just flip her this way. Get her in there. Look at that cab detail. Unpainted, but yeah, it's fine. Move to the back. Kind of styling there. Uh, sadly, no spoon buffers, but that is okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, we're okay. So let's flip it to the other side. Right, so I'll be careful. It's kind of like handling a record. Huh. It's kind of funny because I got like three Beatles records. Uh, sorry for any background noise. Just, uh, it's just my mother. Uh, it's Christmas day, of course, so everything's still stressful. So, just gonna zoom out. And so. Yeah, well, she seems pretty good. Um, I was really happy with the detail um, on her. It was just amazing. Um, let's move along. It's great detail. Like, look at that. You get the you get the uh, throttle, I believe it is. Uh, and even inside here, you get coal, like coming down the sides. This is beautiful. 
beautiful and the riveting's beautiful the details beautiful i love this handrail handrail's great there's great detail on here folks especially for an older model uh now that it's not a fat coupling at all um yeah so i think we should put her on the track and see what she's like just to let you know uh this i've already ran her in today so yeah all right so see you in a second all right she is on the track backwards uh she's a little bit of a rough runner but that's okay because she's old forward back again look at that all right and off she goes You know, folks, she looks good, but I think she needs either coaches or a freight train, a good strain, and I think we're going to put on a good strain since she is uh, a Dean's good train. Alright, so I've pulled over some uh, freight cars, and uh, I'll put them on. So, I'll do the strawberry tanker first, then the van. Then the oil one, the oil tanker, then the soda or fuel tanker, and then my Hornby Railroad uh, British Rail brake, brake van. So, yeah. Looks like a beautiful loco. A beautiful train. So, uh, yeah, we'll continue with this now. Well, I think she's had a pretty good performance for a older loco, and I think I'll end this video here. Uh, remember to like, subscribe down below, <clears throat> and leave a comment, and I will see you next time.